Hi, my name is Brian, aka Avalon Star, and let's talk about paladins. Yes, paladins, the special tank that definitely has something wrong with them, but its parents love it anyway, or every Dark Knight's first job. But really, I love paladins and have always loved this class as a whole, no matter what RPG, MMO, or otherwise they were featured in. But to be fair, paladins went through a lot this past expansion, which led to such an outcry from PLD mains to the developers for a change. I mean, the fact that you were at a distinct disadvantage when enter entering any of the Alexandra raids, even though people obviously made it work, definitely made that cry seem louder. But before we talk about the hard-hitting changes, it's interesting to note how much Gladiator was necessary in order to be a tank with any use in the first place, and how many of those skills are now cross-role. Provoke, Rampart, you're welcome warriors, and Convalescence. Paladin even lost awareness to the cross roll gods, but despite that, there are a few changes worth mentioning my impressions of. Oh, and uh, Spirits Within is gone, along with any mention of that uh, one movie from back, back then. The first is that Royal Authority now combos off of Riot Blade instead of Savage Blade. That just makes it, this just makes sense and was an error to have it any other way. Can't even remember all the times that a paladin tried to switch to DPS mode after tank swap only to pry away aggro because anything they did would generate and obviously it was my fault, right? Yeah, I'll, I'll take the blame here. Now, paladins have one tank combo ending with Rage of Halone and an actual non-emnity generating damage combo uh, ending with either Goring Blade or Royal Authority. Oh, and by the way, Shield Bash doesn't break combo anymore. And before we go on, we can't forget to mention Total Eclipse of the Heart, which is that lovely new AoE skill that doesn't generate enmity. Gone are the days of itchy AoE trigger fingers on Circle of Scorn. And funny enough, uh, Total Eclipse is a level 46 skill, so you actually get it before you get Scorn. So people can get used to that instead of using Scorn all the time. Uh, the next point has to do with Oath Gauges, with, his, with specific focus on the Shield Oath Gauge. This differs from any of the other tank gauges in that it's the only one that can't be filled using weapon skills. You need to block. So now block rate, you know, remember that lovely number that none of us paid attention to in the Shield tooltips? And the skills that improve block rate are essential in being able to use skills that are now tied to it. So like the brand new Intervention, which gets buffed if you happen to have Rampart or Sentinel active. The reworked Sheltron, which no longer requires MP, has no cooldown, eats 50 gauge, meaning that you can use it back to back if needed. And then everybody's favorite passage of arms, Angel Wings, get behind me chat, protection, which increases your block rate by 100%, mind you, which is more food for your lovely gauge. Now, we didn't even really go over new Sword Oath or the new Sword Oath or DPS, but with Holy Spirit, and I still don't quite know how I feel about cast times on Paladin, uh, Requiscat, if that's even how you pronounce it, which you should only use at over 80% MP, mind you, and a lower cost for Clemency, which is down to 1440 at level 70 instead of 2121 at Heaven's, Ward, Heaven's Ward's level 60. Stormblood's Paladin rids itself of all the awkwardness that a casual such as myself ran into trouble with. So I hope if you're a Paladin main out there that you do enjoy Paladin. I, I feel like they did put a lot of work into it. And I hope you enjoy it as much as you probably, hopefully, enjoyed this video. And if you did, please, if you're on Twitch, leave us a follow and maybe even subscribe to the channel to help us out. And if you're watching this on YouTube, please uh, leave us a like and uh, subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching, everybody, and until next time, I'll see you when I see you.